today we're going to be running a power line from the fuse box over here and the ground line across the floor up behind the passenger seat across the hump down the other side and into that gap over there and then we're going to be running some RCAs from the gap back underneath the floor over on that side along the floor line on the driver's side and up into the dash right about where the light switch is so we have four uh, nuts here or studs we have 24 volt that is switched by the ignition we have 24 volt that comes straight from the battery group we have 12 volts that is switched by the ignition and 12 volts that come straight for the battery group so what we're going to do is we're going to tie into the 12 volts that comes straight from the battery on the back side and run our lines, our 8 gauge wire over to the amp. Oh, and I disconnected the batteries back at the back. Let's just make sure we don't have a bunch of juice. Right, one, we're good. Nice rat's nest in here. Oh, mouse droppings and everything. Okay, first step clean this. Mm, hot device. We got a nice big opening back here in the back that we can run our lines down to. Here's the wires that are coming in from the battery. Here's the 12 volt bank coming in and then here's the 24 volt line coming, coming in and then we have a ground that goes to a grounding strap on the far back here and all your switch controls are grounded to this strap. For all your circuit breakers, I should say. Yeah, let's set that aside. And let's pop this bottom panel off. One other thing we need to figure out what we're going to do is where we're going to put in the 40 amp fuse for the amplifier. Right on the ground right there. Wire down there because that's going to go in the easier access to here. No, we're going to go through this hole. No, I'm going to go through this hole because it's already got a grommet. Yeah, okay, we're going to go through that hole because we have a nice grommet. That's 12 volts to battery. So we end up connecting like that. Follow this guy out onto there. Hook in to the fuse block there. Click fuse out. If this thing ever blows, that big damn dash apart. But there's no place to put it on top. And there is nowhere else to put a 40 amp circuit without getting into some serious trouble. Okie dokie. And again. Until we figure out how to get this bad boy mounted to. Oh, hey look. We have ourselves some, probably, it is M6. We have a grommeted spot right back up in here that we can run to and then snake our stuff back over around this side down behind these extra air lines and then in along the floor should be good. That is where our 40 amp fuse will be. It's not perfect, but it is the only place I can see to put it. Now let's finish running that wire down there. Got 
got some, of course, black string you can't see on camera. <laughs> and we're gonna measure out length for RCAs. Okay, let's pull the dash off. Huh. Memory card air. That's not good. Finally got that thing cut with the grommet. Wires are run. Well, now that we got a giant hole, make some aluminum cover. <laughs> Such an idiot. Connected.